The wait staff and the accommodations on the Rocky Mountaineer train is superb. Lake Louise and Banff are two extraordinary destinations in British Columbia, Canada. I met people from around the world who shared this trip of a lifetime. Around every turn was another magical sight. Rocky Mountaineer is the only way to travel, and it was an unforgettable experience. You know, when I think of a dream vacation, I can't think of a better place to come to than Banff because it's heaven. I'm 7,500 feet up in the air on Sulphur Mountain. At the Banff Springs Hotel, you can rest your head. It's a perfect place where you can have a honeymoon, singles can come, couples, it's for everybody. And you can even bring your dog. And the view is spectacular, looking into the mountains, the glaciers, it's heaven, I love it. There are amazing florals throughout British Columbia. The Banff Springs Hotel is a very special hotel. It's one of my favorite Fairmont hotels. I am Lori Grant, Regional Director of Public Relations for Fairmont Hotels and Resorts. We're here on the balcony of the Fairmont Banff Springs, which in 2008 celebrates 120 years of service excellence. This site was specifically chosen by the Canadian Pacific Railway to invite guests from all over the world. For the 120 years, we've welcomed people from Canada, the United States, all across Europe, the Asia Pacific Rim, and Australia. This site, as you can see behind me, is situated in amongst beautiful mountain peaks and at the convergence of the Bow and Spray Rivers. My name is Ian Benz, and I'm the executive chef at the Bampshire Club Kitchen. And we use a lot of local ingredients uh, a lot of local farms, a lot of wild ingredients, wild mushrooms, um, all of our fish are wild, we don't use any farmed fish. We actually created a grill to sit on top of our own grill, um, it has maple wood charcoal on the top and the bottom, so it gets extremely hot, um, like just red hot, so it really sears the meat and we also use a, um, a very unique rub that we rub into the meat and that just creates like a crust on top of and the bottom of the meat at the same time and that's kind of our specialty. Local fruits and vegetables are a very important part of our menu and of our cuisine. We have a great selection of wines. Um, I think we have about 600 different wines at the moment. And we do have a sommelier who works with the guests. But from the moment a guest does walk into our dining room, um, we offer a spectacular uh, setting, uh, our unique menu, our, all of our wine pairings, as well as the extraordinary scenery outside the door, all compiles to make um, an amazing experience. I've really enjoyed my stay here in Banff. This is a place where you can come and relax. And often I say you can hear the whispers of life, you can hear the whispers of life because you're out with nature. The rolling mountains, the beautiful greens, the florals, everything here is just magical. The Banff Hotel is just the best place to stay and rest your head. I love it here and I can't wait to return. It's also a place not only for honeymooners, singles, couples. The Banff Gondola is open year round. We do shut down for a two week or a 10 day period in uh, early January for our yearly maintenance. Uh, the gondola capacity is um, approximately 700 per hour. Uh, there are four person gondola cars. These gondola cars can uh, take uh, a regular wheelchair. One of the other unique features of the Banff Gondola is once you're at the summit at 7,500 feet, uh, we have what we call the Banff Skywalk. And it's just under one kilometer of elevated boardwalk that connects to one of the nearby peaks, which is called Sanson's Peak. I can't think of a better holiday than coming to Banff and riding up the gondola 7,500 feet into heaven. And this panoramic view of the mountains, it's heaven. I love it. You know, this was an energetic experience paddling the blue canoe on the Bow River.
through the scenic and picturesque Rocky Mountains on the Rocky Mountaineer train. Well, we have some different uh, needs uh, as a menu, so you can have uh, lots of requests with diabetes, with uh, gluten-free, with uh, allergies. So that's one of the, we really try to pay attention and please as much as we can uh, all of those guests. So very uh, attention to the, to the detail on the, on the special need diet. On the Rocky Mountain uh, train, we do uh, offer a selection of wine, the local uh, BC wine, which is made in Okanagan. At every turn, there are amazing and spectacular views of mountains and glaciers and lakes. Lake Louise and Banff are two extraordinary destinations in British Columbia, Canada. I woke up one morning and turned the television on, and there was a movie with Carmen Miranda on Lake Louise. I jumped out of my bed, and there was this magical, unbelievable sight to behold of the lake and the glaciers. Rowboating is the best exercise, especially with the scenic views of rolling glaciers and fresh aquamarine water. This is the end of a fantastic holiday. We first started in Vancouver. And Vancouver, as you know, is the third largest city in all of Canada. I would say that people make the difference. And we met the most incredible woman who invited us on her friend's yacht. And we met these incredible Russians who drank vodka into the night. It was quite a celebration. Then we took the Rocky Mountaineer train, which is a luxury train, through all the scenery of the glaciers and the mountains, the rolling mountains. It was so picturesque. I mean, you can imagine in your head all of this beauty. It's back to nature. And then we landed in Banff, and we had such an incredible thing going up on the cable car for an aerial view of the whole city. I can't begin to tell you what it was like there. And we rowboated. I mean, talk about exercise, outdoor. And the whole thing of being able to breathe fresh air was so extraordinary. And then we landed here at Chateau Lake Louise for this incredible scenery of the glaciers. More glaciers, more mountains. This is, unfortunately, the end of our holiday. But remember, get up, get out, and travel. I look forward to seeing you next week for more adventures around the world.